starting lineups. Here's a look. Let's take a moment now for the Sprite ice cold keys to the game. Clark, how about Oklahoma City? What do they need to do to secure a win? They've done an excellent job getting to the foul line an awful lot here recently. So what do you have to do? You've got to make sure you make them shoot over good defense without fouling. Don't give them chances at the foul line. Thanks, Clark. Here's Brooks. Five on the shot clock. And it's the Thunder with the ball. Here's Green from close range. Stripped it away. Oklahoma City on D to Brooks. Hit by Yao. Off the pick. The rebound by Jeff Green. Here's Oklahoma City. Harden to Kristich. Off his leg. And it's being called a kickball. Thomas is in at center. It's on D. Six seconds to shoot. Thomas inside, working on Yao. Durant, no good from three-point land. So it's Houston now. Here's McGrady, scores the opening field goal. And it's about time I was wondering if they were ever going to knock a shot down. To the elbow. Here's Westbrook, buries the short-range jump. Russell Westbrook played two years of college basketball at UCLA, Kevin, and I fell in love with him there. I like his personality, I like his athleticism, and all of that has been on display in his first season in the NBA. He's a guy who's kind of brought that team together with his personality and his presence. And then on the court, you talk about a guy who can finish and defend any perimeter position and who competes hard. He's a promising young player in the backcourt for Oklahoma. Kevin, that's the kind of shot you want. You can't ask for better execution on offense, but sometimes they just don't fall. One on the clock. Can't hit, so Oklahoma City will take it the other way. 107 left in the first. It's picked off by Scola. And here comes Aaron Brooks. Now here's Scola. He's covered by Westbrook. The jump hook. The Thunder looking for their first lead of the game. To Durant. Brooks covering. Fires from 14. And here are the Rockets now. And here is Young. He's covered by Westbrook. And the basket by Scola. You've got to close out on that mid-range jump shot. He's extremely deadly from there. Here comes Durant. Harden. On the mark with the triple. The Thunder with the slight lead. Well, Kevin, they've played great defense. It's been an absolute clinic at that end of the floor. If I had to point out an area for improvement, it would be on the offensive glass. 
They need somebody to get in there, mix it up, and come away with a few extra possessions. And the first quarter comes mercifully to a close. The score, five to four. Welcome to the start of the second quarter, and so far it's been a great game, closely contested by both teams. Let's quickly go down to Cheryl Miller for an update. Well, I had a moment to speak with the head coach of the Thunder. I asked him what his game plan was, and he said they're really at their best when they attack the basket and don't settle for jump shots. Coach went on to say that he feels his team's ability to finish at the rim will be key in this matchup. Well, with their athleticism, it sounds like a good plan. With the players on their roster, that's a great plan. And here are the Rockets. Kevin Durant picking up that last basket. Landry to Lowry. Almost a three-point opportunity. Instead, he'll go to the line for two. That's a no-brainer. You got to stop the layup there. Make him earn his points from the line. Lowry shooting two. Can't sink the first. Good on number two. And here are the Thunder now. Left wing. Here's Green, in close, blocked, out of bounds. And they'll keep possession. And here are the Thunder now. The handoff to Collison, working on Yao. Over Yao, drops it in from beyond the arc. He has five. And there he goes. He didn't get a three in the first. But starting to look for it here. Here's Yao. His first shot is in the bank. Way to work it inside to get the high percentage. Look, nice job there. Thunder changing it up. And it's the Thunder with the ball. It's a three-point game. Livingston to the right wing. To Kristich. Six seconds to shoot. The jump hook hits the jump hook. Nice bucket by the six year veteran out of Serbia. Doing a great job from the field in this quarter. Really have improved their shooting here. Right wing. Here's Landry working on Collison. From short range. Landry gets the bucket. And as you said earlier, they've improved their shooting in this quarter and look to extend the lead. And Kevin, shooting to me, shooting percentage is always a function of the kinds of shots you're taking. And they're doing a much better job of making the extra pass, 
and getting the ball into the hands of the open man at the right time. He's showing some patience. Yep, exactly. Yeah. Collison in the post. He's guarded by Battier. To Thomas. Jacks up the triple. Good! His offense normally comes and goes, but he'll take that bucket. Coach Adelman calls for a timeout. Some changes for the Thunder. Here's Brooks. 136 left in the second. Screen by Scoa. Shoots it. Kept alive. Yao. And he'll have a chance for a three-point play. Versus, versus Jeff Green picks one up. Good for the three-point play. Yao Ming didn't get to be 7'6 by himself. The DNA, pretty strong. Dad is 6'10". Mom is 6'2", the biggest star in China, and not a bad star in the NBA either. Yao Ming, the tallest player in the NBA, and one of the sweetest shooters in the NBA too. Thomas was parked down low and got hit with the three-second call. The Rockets trail. Yao. Thomas is there. Shoots the three. Scooped up. And low to Scola. Props it in on the layup. That's a good example of excellent communication. The nice lead pass led his teammate right to the rim for the basket. Here's Westbrook. It's blocked. Great play by Yao. 32 seconds left in the half. Here it is. Yeah. Yeah. Now that's a statement dunk right there, Kevin. Clear the runway for your own protection. Here's Westbrook. And here is Green. Skull is there. Green, no luck. The D served it up on the platter, and he still wasn't able to convert. He's got to be disappointed. Misses the buzzer beater. Well, that was a closely contested first half. Yeah, if the game keeps up like this, it could be a nail bite. We've reached halftime with the score 16 to 15. Let's go to the T-Mobile Halftime Report. All right, let's look at the team stats. The Rockets have built a small lead by pounding the ball inside and looking for the close-range shots. Nothing wrong with that at all, Kevin. Good, solid, fundamental basketball. Yao Ming really has his fingerprints all over this one. Well, I'll tell you what, Kevin. He's done a great job of contesting shots. He's the leading shot blocker through the first half. Welcome, everyone. The second half of this 2K Sports NBA presentation getting underway. We've got quite a battle going on in this one. Oklahoma City trailer. Oh, 
Here's Durant. Knocks down the trifecta. Eight points for him. No surprise there, Kevin. One of the keys to the game is ability to light up a scoreboard, as we're seeing with our very own eyes. Mud Freddy with the ball. Six seconds to shoot. Score. Hits the front rim and in. Nice shot by the third-year man out of Argentina. To Durant. Green. Five on the shot clock. Here's Harden. Rebound by Yao Ming. He's usually automatic from that close. The defense must have affected him. All right, let's go over to the sideline with Cheryl Miller. Yeah, during halftime, I spoke with the head coach of the Thunder. He tried to explain how one part of the game needs to be fixed right now. They need to step it up. And coach feels they aren't playing at the level they're capable of. And it's time to bring their A games out to finish this game. I'll keep you posted with any updates. Kevin and Clark? Okay, thanks. Here's Westbrook. 2.47 left in the third. Here's Green. It's short, but gets the kind bounce. Just like they drew it up in practice, Kevin. Sweet dish inside. No gentleman wants to talk it over. Brooks wasn't watching the line there. That's going to be an over and back. He's swatting down anything that is thrown at the hoop. When you have a big presence in the middle like that, how do you adjust your game? The key is to go in there strong and with confidence. And you also can't rush. You've got to take your time and concentrate on the rim when you're facing the shot block. And here are the Thunder now. Kristich was camped in the lane there, and he gets the three-second call. Anderson is in at center. Mug Grady with the ball. Knocks it loose. Stolen by Westbrook. 
He got caught napping. You've got to pay attention and protect the field. Mug Freedy with the ball. Here's Anderson. Right wing. Reza frames it from just inside the three-point line. It's now all evened up at 22. Here's Westbrook. Here's Green. Nails the train. He has five. That's really a magnificent job from the field today. I mean, they're lighting it up here in the second half, and you've got to attribute it to their concentration and their ball movement. I mean, they're getting the shots they want, and they're knocking them down. And that one's good. Look, Brady. He'll make that shot all game long. The defense has got to get over the top of that screen. Here's Green off the screen. No luck. And the Rockets going the other way now. One of the ways where they've shown a definite edge, Kevin, has come on the glass today. Mug Freddy with the ball. Now here's Scope. He's covered by Westbrook. Fires from the right block. And the basket by Scola. Talk about that rebounding edge, Clark. That's definitely had an impact for them in this game. Well, I think you open up your opportunities, Kevin, when you can stay strong in the, in the paint area and control the boards. I mean, that's a critical element in winning basketball games, rebounding the ball. Westbrook can't get it to go. And here we go with Tracy McGrady. Brooks can't get the buzzer beater. We're at the end of the third quarter, and we've still got a close one. It's 26 to 25. Yao Ming has played his heart out. Five points and six rebounds. Yeah, not flashy numbers, but his presence has definitely been felt out there. It's little things, Kevin. He's getting them done. Fourth quarter about to get started here in what's been an entertaining game. Welcome back to what's been a fantastic game. Closely contested by two teams that obviously want to win it very badly as we begin play in this much-anticipated fourth quarter. Here's Brooks. To T-Mac. To the middle. And here is Battier, defended by Durant. To Battier, behind the arc. Can't get it to go. And the Thunder go the other way. Deflects the pass. The jump off to Westbrook. Green. He's guarded by Battier. Connects on the baseline jumper. They're up 27-26. The Rockets will keep possession. Oklahoma City has just caught on fire and is really locked on from beyond the arc. Everyone seems to be getting involved in the long-range shooting today, Kevin. I've seen teams shoot this well for a short stretch, but they've been on the mark the whole game. It's rare to see a team shoot so well for so long, but they've been feeling it and letting it fly. And so far, so good. Here's Brooks. Five on the shot clock. From deep. Kept alive. Gets in close. Yao, that's good. Kevin, this has been a terrific matchup. Both teams are giving as good as they get. Here's Green. Oh, just missed it. But he drew contact. And he'll head to the line. That's on Yao Ming. Well, he got hammered. 
The D definitely got their money's Three, worth on that foul. He knocks down the first one. Here's a guy in Jeff Green who played at Georgetown for John Thompson III, so you know he's had some good coaching. Yes, sir. Now he comes to the NBA. I think he's been very solid so far. Extremely solid, Kevin. And he's a guy that I think needs to be more assertive in his game. He's got a lot of talent, can do a lot of things. But right now, I think he's a jack of all trade, a master of none. He needs to find one or two things to take to the next level so that he can be a high volume producer and I think he can do that as a scorer and as a defender here's Westbrook following the shot by Tracy McGrady uncovered Durant leads the game and assists he's been extremely active out there and he has the stats to prove it. terrific hustle to the elbow Brooks sinks it wow it's been all offense all game Everybody's got the hot hand. Cheryl, what do you have? Well, guys, I had a chance to talk with the Thunder. He wants them to post up more. He thinks they can take advantage down there. We'll see if he's right. Guys? All right, thanks, Cheryl. And it's the Thunder with the ball. They lead by one. Kristich defended by Yao. On loads. Here's Durant. A follow-up champ. Came out of nowhere to slam that rock back in. And here is Yao. He has seven. Patio. Green with the rebound. 138 left to the fourth. Here's Westbrook. Buries it. That's a great pass. Way to get it to the open man. Rockets trail. Here's Brooks. Takes it up. Count it. And the foul. Jeff Green picks one up. They've raised their field goal percentage just above 50% here. They actually look like a totally different team than what we saw in the first half. Much better execution offensively. He completes the three-point play. Oh, man. Huge and one with the game still up for grabs. That gives them a big boost. Harden. Yeah, holds it in, and that's his eighth rebound of the contest. Here's Brooks, inside, kept alive. T-Man, outside. 
The three won't fall. Boy, they've really been scrapping for rebounds in this one. Neither club really dominating the other one. The Thunder with the lead. Less than one minute left. Harden, Reza covering. Christich. Rebounded by Tracy McGrady. And you're right about the dog fight, Clark. You can tell that both teams really want this. Yeah, without question. And with it being as close as it is right now, a hard-fought game, you, you expect this intensity to keep up. Here's Westbrook following McGrady's three-point attempt. The Thunder will look to run down the clock. The alley-oop. Brooks lays out. Deflected. And it's picked up by the Rockets. 20 seconds left in the game. And here is Yao. To the paint. Here's Brooks. Oh, can't bury the shot to send it to OT. The Thunder win the hard-fought game as they outlast the Rockets. 35 to 33. Kevin Durant is the Jordan Brand player of the game. And he was spectacular. Well, he was the initiator and the playmaker for their offense, Kevin. He kept his head up and created a bunch of easy scores with his passing. Time for us to say goodbye. For Clark Kellogg, Cheryl Miller, and me, Kevin Harlan, thanks for joining us for this presentation of the NBA on 2K Sports.